Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix slow motion issue with the game on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to restart your computer. Restarting computer has worked for many players, so it might work for you. Simply restart your computer and then you can check. If that does not work, next step is to launch the game from the game installation folder. So instead of, instead of launching the game from EA app or Steam, uh, you can go to the game installation folder. If you have the game on EA app, click on manage, now click on view properties and then click on open folder and then make a double click launch the game from here and then check if that does not work you can even run as administrator and then check similarly if you have the game on steam you can just make a right click on the game select manage browse local files and then make a make a double click launch the game from here and then check if that does not work you can even run as administrator you can even try to launch the game using ea anti cheat game service launcher make a right click and then click on run as administrator and then check you can do the same thing if you have the game on ea now the next step is to enable XMP in System BIOS. Now for this, uh, you can go to System BIOS. This has worked for many players, so it might work for you. So you can try this. You can shut down your computer and then start the computer. Tap the BIOS key. It may be F2 or any other key. For different brands, the BIOS key are different. You can search in Google uh, how to go to System BIOS. And when you go to the System BIOS, if you find XMP, uh, you can enable it. Uh, so for different brands, the XMP uh, option may be in different locations. So make sure that you find XMP and you can enable it. For many uh, system, uh, you may not find this XMP. In that case, you can skip this step. Now, the next step is to update the system BIOS. So go to your system manufacturer website, select your model number. So if you have a Dell computer, go to Dell website. If you have a Lenovo computer, go to Lenovo. Whichever brand you have, go to their website find the latest by select your model number make sure that you select your computer and then update the bias and then check next step is to you can, uh, do not try this step if you're not sure about it and if you can't do it you can take help from your pc manufacturer so if your computer has a dual channel memory motherboard then make sure that ram is set up for dual channel now for this the two memory modules should be placed into slots labeled one or three one and three or two and four to create dual channel memory configuration now dual channel requires you to install the modules the memory modules to alternate slots not by side by side but actually alternate slot for example if your motherboard has a four uh, motherboard has four slot this is just an example then the first memory module should be installed in the first slot and the second memory module should be in the third slot so make sure that you have this uh, configuration uh, for your RAM if you have a dual channel memory motherboard. Now, this has also worked for many players, so it might work for you. Next step is to try different upscaling. Uh, try VSync off or on, switch to full screen or window mode. So launch the game. So once you launch the game, uh, you can go to settings and then go to graphics over here. Then click on advanced option. Now over here, you can see upscaling technique. In my case, this is off and it's working fine for me. You can try DLSS or you can even go for FSR. Check which one is working fine for you. And then you can check. And you can also uh, go to graphics and then turn off or turn on the V-Sync. So over here, if the V-Sync is on, you can turn it off and then check. If it is already off, you can turn it on and then check. Which check which one is working fine for you now you can even try window mode so if if it is set to borderless you can try full screen you can even go window mode you can select window mode and then you can check the performance now it's still not working close all kinds of recording or streaming application this has also worked for many players so if you have any streaming or a recording software like obs you can close those application and then you can launch you have to relaunch the game and then check Next step is to try Ethernet connection. So if you have an Ethernet port, like if your computer has an Ethernet port, and if you have, if you have an Ethernet cable, you can switch to wired connection and then check. You can even try switching to different networks. So if you have any other network available, you can try to switch to different network, and then you can check. Make sure that you have stable internet, and then relaunch the game. Next step is to install the game on Steam or eApp. So for beta version, you can, uh, if you have the game on Steam, you can install eApp and you can try to play the game from eApp. And then if you have the game on eApp, then you can even try Steam and then you can check. 
this has also worked for a few players so it might work for you next step is to run the game on dedicated graphic card now for this type in graphic settings in windows search box click on graphic settings and then click on add desktop app and then go to the game installation folder wherever the game is installed select the game exe file click on add once the game is added click on the game and for gpu performance uh, gpu preference select high performance over here and then you will see your graphic card now launch the game next is to perform a clean installation of your graphics card driver so if you have nvidia card go to nvidia website if you have amd card go to amd website i'm showing for nvidia so go to the website and over here uh, uh, you can select your graphic card your operating system and then click on find whichever is the latest graphic card driver on this page you have to install that uh, just download that driver uh, whichever is the latest click on view and then download that file and once the download is complete you can run the exe file once you run the exe file you will see the screen select nvidia graphics driver over here and then click on agree and continue select custom option over here and then click on next and then put a check on the box which says perform a clean installation then click on next after the clean installation restart your computer and then launch the game still not working the last step is to verify or repair the game file if you have the game on e app click on manage click on repair after the repair launch the game and then check if you have the game on steam make a right click on the game select properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrity of game files after the verification launch the game and then check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix the slow motion issue so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel